Hi, I'm Karen Bobatick. This is Houston Artists Stories. I'm here with April Murphy for Houston Artist Stories. It was an incredible experience. There are, you know, over 1,200 people that apply for those spots and they choose about 300. And then out of those 300, they pick a featured artist. And to be that one uh, just blew my mind. And the exposure it brings, I can't even begin to describe how wonderful that was. You know, there were radio interviews, there were, you know, various TV stations that wanted to talk to me. I was really grateful for that because I really feel like I have a story to tell to people who are wanting to be an artist and that, you know, it can happen for anyone if you work really hard. And um, so, yes. Well, I was actually laid off uh, from a corporate marketing uh, graphic design job from a bank and it didn't feel good, but um, it just meant that I was not meant to go that path anymore. And so I decided I'm gonna take a few weeks and just, do something that, you know, really feels good to do and not for the long term, but just for right now. And so um, I went and got my hair done. <laughs> and then after that, I swung by the art store and bought some uh, canvases and paints and uh, came home and started painting. And I had three or four that were starting to stack up. So I took them over to the Starbucks where the uh, manager, um, I'd gone by and gotten my drink every morning on the way to that corporate job. And he was like, sure, hang them up on the walls. And I did, and uh, they started selling immediately. And so I just sort of went, aha, this is something, you know? And um, I never looked back and never, you know, I'm blessed that they laid me off, actually, yeah. I call my art feel-good art because I think that's what it does for people. So when people walk in, they just start smiling or sometimes they start laughing. As an example, there was a photo fest exhibit that was here uh, a few months ago and the subject matter was very heavy, beautiful photography, but also uh, very thought for broking and, uh, and um, deep. And so people would wander through the halls and look, look at that exhibit and then they would wander into my studio and they would just kind of go, oh, like it's a break. And I love that, I love that what I do for a living can give that to people. Houston is a great place to do art. You know, I mean, there's so much opportunity here and that's the thing about when you're starting out as an artist here, I think there is so much, you know? And so if you just have your ear to the ground and start looking for places where you can pop up your art, you can get so much experience. And, and then this community where I am right now, Winter Street, and there are three other buildings here, it's such a great place to make art. And they have so many plans that are gonna be happening in the next few years, and I'm never leaving as long as I'm doing artwork here because they're of the things that are about to happen to this uh, Washington Arts District. Yeah. Thank you, April Murphy, and that's a wrap.